the top 10 baby products to sell on your dropshipping stores for 2021, which is going to be an amazing year for dropshipping, an amazing year for e-commerce business owners. So if you're in that category or you're just thinking of getting started, here is another product finding video from us to you to help you along your journey and to help you in this niche specifically, which has been booming this year and next year is going to be even bigger and better. Watch this quick intro. Let's begin. What's up everybody? My name is Liran from AutoDS. I'm the content producer and I've also been dropshipping for the last four years. And as I've mentioned in this video, we are going to cover the top 10 baby products to sell in your dropshipping stores if you want to have great success in this specific niche too along the way. Now we have a lot of product finding videos which we have been uploading recently. So check out our blogs, check out our YouTube channel. And if you are new to our YouTube channel, this is the part where you need to subscribe to always stay updated on valuable videos like this one. We have a lot of them coming out, not just on product finding, but also on strategies for dropshipping, how to maintain and control your dropshipping stores and how to automate your business and so many helpful subjects along the way. Now, without wasting any more time, let's get on with the top 10 list for the top 10 baby products that you need to add to your dropshipping stores to succeed in this niche. So let's begin. Number one on the list, we have organic baby wipes. So you know about baby wipes, it's well, baby wipes, but in this case, they are organic, which means it's more environmental friendly. It's more friendly and healthy to our planet Earth. And that is a very important topic. So people are searching for these specific wipes. There is a bunch of them if you just search them within your suppliers. And like I always mention, if you are working with only one supplier and you can't find a certain product from that supplier, that is why you should always work with three suppliers so that you will always be able to find the product that you are looking for. So I just moved from AliExpress to Walmart and in Walmart, I am seeing good results. So I won't touch Vero products and trademark companies like Huggies but there are a lot and more than enough of other sellers who are selling this product and they would be more than happy if you were to drop ship it off of them. So work with three suppliers. One is obviously not enough and more than that may be a little bit too confusing and challenging. So organic baby wipes is number one on the list and that means that you need to add 20 of these products so that you will be able to analyze it correctly. So organic baby wipes is number one on the list. Make sure that they are organic because if they're just regular baby wipes, you're going to be overwhelmed with way too many products and they will mostly be saturated because it's a very general product. Now let's move on to number two on the list. And on number two, we have hand and footprint ornament kits. This is a really cool product that parents use on their kids and on their babies to have the memories of their handprint and their footprint while they were young. Because if you guys are parents, then you know just as well as I do, how fast our children grow and every time when you're looking at their photos one or two years back you're always looking at the differences and thinking to yourself wow how fast did they grow too bad i didn't get more memories so you dip the baby's hand or foot in the ink and then on the paper and then you can frame it keep it as a memory and that is exactly what this product is trying to do so as you can see walmart doesn't seem to have them but aliexpress does have them and if i search for it on amazon i'm sure i will find it too that is why, once again, you need to work with more than one supplier. And do not forget that AutoDS supports more than 20 suppliers, which means you'll always have access to millions of products. So you'll never get to the point where you're looking for an item and you won't find it. And as you can see now here, we have a lot. And it's not just in ink, as you can see here. So hand or footprint ornament is number two on the list. Now we're moving on to number three. And here we have inflatable water play mats. This is a really popular product. Let me show you. It's pretty self-explanatory from the title, but I want you guys to see the different variations and price points that you can get here. So AliExpress, as you can see here, big selection. Walmart has them too, even though some products here look the same. Now let's look for a little variety in this product, which is once again, why you need to work with more than one and more than two suppliers. Okay, so here we go. The best variations that I can find are right here in front of me. And these are all inflatable water play mats. And as you can see, they are fairly cheap. These are low ticket to maybe medium ticket prices, which means it'll be easier to sell these products. And this is another product that we have seen booming recently in sales. And I guess it makes sense with all the stuff that we had going on in 2020. So inflatable water play mats, 
add them to your list which means add 20 of them and let me show you guys a little trick that i love to use when i'm adding a whole bunch of products to my store and there's just not enough time to do that when you're adding 50 100 or more products a day even less it takes a lot of time and one of the things that helps you out with that is this little auto ds extension that you see down here now if you don't know what it is go to google write auto ds helper on the search bar and the first result click on it which is the auto ds dropshipping helper extension so it's a chrome add-on extension and once you install it go back to the supplier page that has all of the products that you want to add for example this one refresh the page if you just installed the extension now and then you'll see the circle down here once you click on that circle and you click on the extract button over here then all of the product ids that we see on this page just extracted into this little extension that we have down here now what you need to do is click on export as csv and as you see a little export file was downloaded onto my computer the next step is to open the AutoDS platform and while I'm recording this video for all of you guys who are with us on eBay this is not the layout that you're seeing yet but you will be seeing it soon enough for all of you guys who are with us on Shopify you're already seeing this layout so once you download that extension click on add products on the left side and then click on upload CSV here you can drag and drop that CSV file or you can click on it to open up your file browser window and navigate to where you downloaded that file double click on it processing csv and file is uploaded now make sure that the options down here below are correct then click on next and now you'll go through all of the import configuration for those 60 something products that we have in that export file so you're going to choose whichever template you want to use on them whatever product tag you want to use and this is a very smart thing to do so since we're importing baby products, we're going to call it baby products. So we're creating a tag called baby products. And in a month or two, when we'll want to come back and analyze how the niche went for all of our baby products, I can simply tell AutoDS that these are the products that I want to see, all of the products under this tag, and it will show me only them. This way, it's much easier to organize yourself and to analyze your performance and multiply the success for the products that are selling well for you and delete the ones that are not selling or are not getting enough views, watchers, or interests. Now, once you're done filling in your settings, click on next. You'll be taken to your pricing, shipping, and policies, and then you'll be able to import the products to your store or to the drafts page where you can continue to optimize them and then import them to your store and have AutoDS start to monitor them. So that is how easy it is to import tens to hundreds to thousands of products without any hassle. So that's a quick tip. Now let's go back to the list of the top 10 products. So we are done with number three, which was the inflatable water playmats. Now let's move on to number four. And on number four on the list, we have diaper backpacks with changing pads. So as you can see, there is a general niche here, which we micro niched twice to find this hot seller. And that is exactly what it is, a diaper backpack. Can you guess what the general niche and what the micro niches are here? If you haven't guessed yet, the backpack is the general niche. Diaper backpack is a micro niche. With the changing pad is another feature added to that micro niche. So if you'll just search for backpacks, you're obviously not going to find something that's going to become your next bestseller. Not that easily at least. But if we use all of our micro niche options, we will find what we are looking for. And as you can see here, AliExpress seems a little bit confused. Maybe it's because of the W and slash so you guys always have to test around and play around to see what's going on. And yep, that seemed to be the issue because now we're getting only diaper backpacks with changing pads. So here is a good selection. As we can see, these bags come with medium to high ticket prices, which means you can make some good profit when selling them. Let's check out another supplier. So Walmart also has a nice selection of diaper backpacks with changing pads. And don't forget that every feature that we're adding on is something that people are looking for which means you will want to search for baby backpacks and you will want to include that changing pad inside. So undoubtedly here we are seeing some really good results. This one has 12,000 reviews. This bag has 6,500. This one has 5,000 and they also have variations inside of them, which is something that I do encourage you guys to add. So for example, when you're adding this bag, you can import it to your store with all of its variations or you can import them one by one so that each one will have the main image with its color. You can play around with both options and see which works for you. 
This is another thing that I'm doing on my dropshipping stores and I do find it to be effective. So baby backpacks with changing pads or better yet diaper backpacks with changing pads is number four on the list. Now let's move on to number five. And now we are on dispenser for baby wipes. So you have the baby wipes, which we talked about. And now we are talking about dispensers for the baby wipes. So these are just little cute boxes that will hold the baby wipes inside of them. So you're not buying the baby wipes. You're just buying the dispensers for them. And as you can see here, we are already starting to see those results. We can see that this product is selling a lot. Let's search it up really quick with our other suppliers. So as you can see, we have them here too and different variations with colors. So this is another good one to add to your list. And if you remember when I mean add to your list or when I say add to your list, I mean that you need to add 20 of them. Here we also have some nice results. So dispensers for baby wipes, another good product that has been selling a lot recently. It's an evergreen product inside an evergreen niche, which means these products are selling all year long because babies are not seasonal. Babies are being born every day and these products are needed every day. Number six on the list, we have teething toys. It's these biteable toys for babies and it also helps them develop their teeth. Well, they're also showing you dog teething toys. So we're going to have to add baby to, to the search here. Always optimize your search. Each supplier is going to show you different things on what they think you are searching for. So do the small optimizations to show exactly what you want to see. And right now we are seeing exactly what we want. So here are the baby teething toys. My recommendation on this category is to add more than the quantity of one because parents will most likely buy more than one unit, especially when they come at a cheap starting price like the ones that we are seeing here. And as you can see, hundreds of people are buying them. Go for products that have good reviews like the ones that we are seeing here. That way you'll know that the products that you are selling are also made of high quality. You also want your customers to be happy with the products that they are buying from you. So don't add products blindly. Make sure that they have good reviews. So four stars and up is good. Teething toys, as you can see on all of the suppliers that I'm searching up with, they all have them and they all have them in different variations. So you won't have a hard time finding some good variations and check these out. 36,000 reviews, 12,000 reviews. I'm not saying that it's going to be easy to sell these specific products with all of these reviews because they're probably saturated, but you can play around with the titles. You can play around with the product descriptions. You can play around with who you are showing these ads to if you're dropshipping on Shopify, and then you'll have no problem even selling products that are saturated and on eBay when you're optimizing the titles. So now let's move on to the next product. After we're done with teething toys, we're up to number seven. And now we have diaper caddy storage bins, another product that is selling very, very well for dropshippers. And well, quite frankly, it fits the dropshipping business model perfectly. So diaper caddy storage bins is this product that you're seeing in front of me right here. It's a very simple and good organizer. You can even put it on the cart as you can see here. And another good thing that I love about this product is that it's hard to pinpoint the exact price. And I've talked about this before in my previous product finding videos. When you find a product that you can't just go to some local store and find that exact same product, then hey, you can do pretty much whatever you want with this product, especially if not a lot of dropshippers are selling it. And even if they are, there are ways to differentiate yourself and get this product in front of the right audience for you, whether you're dropshipping on eBay or Shopify. So diaper caddy storage bins, add them to your list. Of course, that means add 20 of them. Go for a variation of best sellers, new releases, and also try to check out what other people are selling and what is selling successfully for them in this product line. But if you just follow my advice, you will get those sales and you will learn how to multiply them also along the way. So diaper caddy storage bins are number seven on the list. And this brings us obviously to number eight. And at number eight, we have lead bath toys. Bath toys, which have extra lead lighting, which makes it fancier, more decorative, and much more interesting for the babies to play with while they're taking a shower. I remember when my three and a half year old daughter was just a baby, even though I still see her as a baby today, but when she was one and even less, they didn't like taking showers unless you really learn how to entertain them while they're in the shower. So we gave her toys and whatnot, but when you give them a toy that they are actually interested in, they won't throw it away after one day or get bored of it so quick. So lead bath toys are bath toys like you're seeing in front of me now, except we've noticed that lead bath toys like this one over here is selling a lot more than just regular bath toys. So it's one of those micro niches that we were able to find that is selling a lot and we want you guys to add them to 
to enjoy those cells too along the way. So as you can see here, the product is self-explanatory. Search it up with your three suppliers and add 20 of them to see which of them will sell and continue adding more products that are similar to them. As you can see, they come in different bundles. So you got eight packs and 12 packs and you should always raise the quantity for more than one on these products, even if they come as an eight pack. Maybe your audience wants a 16 pack. Maybe they want 24 pieces. So add a quantity of two to three. And when you will get those extra sales with a quantity of two or three, you will ask yourself why you didn't raise quantities in the first place. So that is number eight on the list, lead bath toys. Now we're moving on to number nine and we're almost done with this, but you have a lot of work to do. On number nine on the list, we have baby play pens. This is a very profitable product to sell. You can guess why, but if you can't, it's because it has a medium to high price range because dropshipping is also all about profiting along the way and not just selling and not working really, really hard for just a few hundred dollars a month. We are here for the thousands and in order to reach the thousands, we need to sell expensive products that will give us good profit on each sell. Now, I'm not saying do not sell cheap products. You need both. You need cheap products for the run rate and you need expensive products to make good profits and end the month with much bigger numbers. So baby play pens, really fun for the kids, just a huge play pen. So they do come in different sizes and different variations. And if you're adding play pens that don't come with plastic balls, be sure to also add plastic balls as an accessory and your customers will add them in the cart along the way. Add baby play pens to your list. Now let's move on to number 10, the last product that we have for you in this video. And on number 10, we are on baby monitors. Now, this baby has been selling for a while, baby pun intended. Now, if we go to one of our suppliers, you will see that baby monitors, some can have cameras, some can only have the walkie talkie, so only audios and no visual. These are usually medium to high ticket prices, which means once again, you will enjoy the profits from selling this product. People are buying this product a lot. And another really quick thing, you see this e-packet thing over here, e-packet free, processing time 33 days, e-packet free, no e-packet. This is another small feature that we have on the AutoDS extension that you can see over here. Once we installed it, it's showing me if this product has e-packet or not because a lot of dropshippers are looking for e-packet and they don't want to go inside each listing one by one to see if it has it inside. So that's another cool little feature that we have with the extension. Now let's go back to the baby monitors. Like I said, medium to high ticket prices, the profits will be good for you. Just make sure to add enough so that you can analyze which baby monitors are selling well for you. See the features that they have inside and add more baby monitors with that feature that is going well for you. Now, sometimes you won't be able to find a special feature and you won't know why one product out of 10 is selling really, really good, really, really well. And it's pretty much similar to the other 10 or other 20 that you have. So this is another part of the game and it's perfectly fine. That's another reason why you need to add more and more until you start getting those sales. Once you're adding products from popular categories, like the ones I'm mentioning in this video, you will get those sales and you will know how to analyze which ones went well, which ones didn't, and we need to throw them away and multiply your success by adding more products that are similar to the ones that are selling. Now, this is a very, very important thing to understand and learn for the dropshipping business model. So that's it for this video for the 10 baby products that you need to add to your stores for 2021. Now, if you appreciate this valuable information that we are passing on to you guys, give us a little like in this video, share this video so that your friends and family can also learn about the wild and amazing world of dropshipping. And like I said in the beginning of this video, if you are new to our channel, this is the part where you need to subscribe so that you can always be updated on special videos like this one on product finding and everything else to automate and help you generate more sales on your dropshipping business. Thank you for watching. See you in the future videos.